home biscuits. Uh, this video is gonna be a little different than my vlog video. It's actually a tag video. I got tagged by a YouTuber here uh, named Lottie Fran, I believe. That's how you say it. If that's not how you say it, girl, please correct me because I really is one of my biggest pet peeves when people uh, don't say my name correctly, so I do my best to make sure I pronounce everyone else's name right. Um, but she tagged me in one of her videos uh, several videos ago, but I will link her video down below. I mentioned her in one of my vlogs, so I hadn't had the time to film the actual tag video, so this is what this is, and I was considering putting it on my other channel, but since she tagged this one, and it is somewhat like getting to know me, uh, which fits right into somewhat of the vlog idea behind uh, this channel so I went ahead and just put it here plus the other channel doesn't really have any subscribers because it was supposed to be a beauty channel but I really haven't had time to do any of that so it makes sense that I put it here so I am going to do five questions actually it's four but the fifth one is I believe who I want to tag and um, just kind of get to know me a little bit better so the first one is uh, what youtubers inspire me most and I would have to say that I have a quite an, a range like wide range of people that I watch on YouTube and I, like I have guilty pleasures I like watching documentaries I like going to that crazy side where everybody say hi to end up in the dark side of YouTube uh, that's all me I will sit there for a long time uh, doing my makeup and watching all kinds of crazy stuff but there is one youtuber uh, her name is Nina unrated if you may watch her or not I liked her because I think she's one of the ones that inspired me the most because she was constantly kind of encouraging people to to do whatever they wanted because she was so out there and her content isn't for everyone but I love 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 her she definitely inspired me because she she really made me feel like I don't care what anybody says about me because if she's willing to put herself out there like that then I could do the same too with my own channel the way that I want to present it but I also believe it or not get inspired a lot by drama channels and it has to do a lot with the same thing because they're so out there and I just I get encouraged not necessarily by the content that they put out but more of the courage that they have to do the stuff that they do like they really are on another level and but I you gotta appreciate that and that to me is very inspiring and that allows me to do what I want to you know the the girls that I'm gonna name at the end um, are also my inspiration because I love watching their stuff I just enjoy people enjoying what they do so that is inspiration enough for me uh, three things I'm good at um, the first one that I've been trying to do more on my videos which I don't show a lot because you know I don't wear makeup every day but I did go to school to be a makeup artist and I did work at that for a while um, but I haven't done it on a more consistent basis which is why I had originally had the idea of having a second channel be like a beauty related channel so that is one thing uh, number two is definitely maybe like my creative side when it comes I'm no expert or professional but I am very self-taught when it comes everything that I know about how to edit uh, videos and and um, how to Photoshop and use things like that uh, social media and everything has all been self-taught and the third one I would say I'm really good at yeah, it's hard to compliment yourself I would have to say maybe my confidence I've briefly talked about this and like how long it's taken me to get here I've always been a very extroverted person it's extroverted a word I don't know but an extrovert I have been but sometimes I use that to mastering things but I think I've gotten out of the shell and I would say I'm very good at that I'm very good at loving myself not a hundred percent of the time I don't know if anyone is but I would have to say 90% of the time I'm pretty good at loving who I am and accepting me as a person and that has allowed me to build better relationships with the people around me especially my very close friends and definitely my family because I've accepted who I am so it kind of leaves them with no choice but to accept me yeah so I would say I'm, I'm pretty good at that I, I like loving myself Myself. Number three, what are three things I'm excited about? Uh, three things. Number one would have to be new movies. I get excited about new movies all the time. Mr. CJ and I love, you know, we're always, especially superhero movies, that is our thing. So I am excited for movies that are, are going to be coming up. Star Wars is coming out in December. Uh, Black Panther is coming out. I am really excited about that movie. So, But just movies in general, we get really excited and especially action and especially superhero. Uh, the second thing I'm excited about is future but in 
regards to like career wise what I want to do and the more nonprofit factor I'm still kind of working things out I actually have a training like a leadership training tomorrow and I love doing that so I'm excited to just get more involved in like nonprofit community very community based organizations and see where that takes me who I can network with what I can get myself into and the last thing I'm excited about I actually have four things obviously this channel and seeing how it grows and seeing you know how much of my creative side and how much I'm gonna express myself um, but I but that was just like an add-on bonus but uh, I would say the third thing I'm excited about is wanting to travel more I know that's a want but I feel like in my head it's gonna happen and I've been making every effort um, and even taking short trips like those small road trips that I've been taking but I'm excited to see new places number four what relaxes me uh sleeping <laughs> I'm not kidding. Sometimes a 20 minute nap, power nap will get me through the day and I will feel refreshed. So yes, sleeping is definitely one of them. I am very relaxed when you sleep and it has been linked to scientific studies that sleeping is a must, you know, everything happens when you're sleeping. Get your good hours of sleep. You won't be as stressed out. You'll have a better, you know, you won't. I, I notice that when I, I sleep more, I'm not starving to death. My anxiety isn't high. So that definitely relaxes me uh number two listening to music um i don't want to say music junkie because i feel like when you say music junkie uh you can hear a song know the artist and know you know when it was released and from what album i'm not necessarily that music junkie but i do love music i listen to music almost 85 percent of my day no matter what i'm doing i usually have music on and i even you know you guys notice me i'm always putting the volume down when i'm picking up the camera because it's always playing in the background and then i realize as i'm vlogging that there's music in the background and it's probably going to be ignored so I just love music I just love music and it really puts me in a really good place and the last thing that relaxes me is video editing um, believe it or not that's why I've been so consistent with it lately you know aside from the fact that I want to genuinely be but a major factor is that it helps me uh, release a lot of stress and the last few months have been pretty stressful nonetheless so I dug I like I zero in when I edit I release all, everything that I'm carrying and I just focus and zone into that so I would Say that's the third thing that relaxes me and number five the long-awaited uh people that i would like to tag for this video the first one is gonna be one of my favorite people on youtube <laughs> miss latanya um her youtube channel all of their links are gonna be down below um just in case you forget you can just open it box so go check out their channels and subscribe to them because they put out awesome content and if i benefit from them i'm sure that you will also benefit and there's nothing like supporting each other like that's the best thing in the world so the first one is lb from lb's weight loss journey um and i love her she's awesome she knows i love her she she kind of posts a lot of stuff actually i wouldn't categorize her channel as anything she just posts a lot of things and she's i love her soothing voice and she's so uplifting second person on here is my life in my corner hi second person i'd like to tag is my life in my corner and um, she's also awesome. She's so supportive, always has encouraging words, and I want to know what relaxes her. <laughs> No, go and uh, check her channel out as well and show her some love. Uh, the third person that um, I haven't seen post lately, but um, she does mostly a lot of her fitness, especially because she is on keto. But uh, her channel name is New Day Fitness, and. Um, yeah, so if you're really into like wanting to know more about keto, she definitely posts her updates and she's very sweet and um, and she'll do like review and vlogs and things like that. So she's awesome. And the fourth person I like to tag is Miss That's Vet CV. If you haven't watched her vlogs, she's really funny. I love watching her. She's out of based out of New York and she's got two kids and her boo. Uh, she calls them boy toy, which I think is hilarious. But she always cracks me up and puts a smile on my face and her kids are adorable so I love watching her and the last 
person or persons really that I would like to tag is actually you you watching the video I know that not everyone makes videos and sometimes you're always watching someone and the reason I say this is because I used to be that person where it's like I I, I kind of want to you know I watch these videos and you tell yourself I kind of want to do that but I don't know just do it start with this tag if you feel like answering if you already have a channel and want to do it tag yourself I'm tagging you if this is the first video you want to make just do it don't be shy don't be embarrassed you know let me know you did it I'll subscribe to your channel and support you because that's what it's all about so yep that's the end of this video and thanks again to Miss Lottie for tagging me and maybe I'll do more tags but I will put them on my other channel uh, so that they can be more fun and things like that and maybe do those kind of videos there and keep this just for vlogging so that link to that channel has always been in the description box you can just go there and subscribe as well so I will see you in my next video bye hey thanks for watching make sure to follow me on all my social media at I am Lolo and don't forget to subscribe